You might not believe it now, but back in high school, I lost 130 pounds in a single year at that. Hi, I'm Steven. In this quick video, I'm going to share my journey of gaining and losing all that fat between 2013 and 2014. If you want to join me on my next journey to lose 200 pounds, please hit that subscribe button. Plus, I'll also be testing high protein recipes from social media to see if they can fit into my diet. So stay tuned for that also. As a kid, I was extremely skinny, but things changed when my family moved from uh, Louisiana to Florida. We started eating cheap, tasty, calorie dense food that wreaked havoc on our bodies at that. My biggest downfall was sugary drinks, especially iced tea. By high school, I hit my heaviest weight at 345 pounds. My turning point really came when my mom got a call from my doctor. She looked super shocked, and uh, after hanging up, she told me that uh, I was pre-diabetic. That was my wake-up call. Determined to make a change, I made a simple but effective first step. I started drinking only water. In just the first month and a half, I lost 30 pounds. Mostly water weight and inflammation, uh, but it was a huge motivator. My family began eating healthier, which helped, but I had limited control over my diet. Instead, I focused on portion control and staying active. I changed my electives to ROTC and weightlifting, uh, but our coach, who was also the track coach, had us running more than lifting, honestly. After school, I played basketball with my friends. Uh, I got better, but I just never got good. And despite not having a car, I also walked everywhere, which also added to my activity levels. I hit several plateaus along the way and I tried to push through them all. One strategy was embracing the placebo effect, which was really a mentality thing. At one point, I had read that cayenne pepper pills could help burn calories, so I took them, and I believe they worked. Uh, it wasn't until a friend had a bad reaction that I had stopped taking them. By the time I graduated, I reached my lowest weight of 215 pounds. While I was much skinnier, I still looked skinny fat and hadn't built much muscle. My face only started losing weight close to graduation, too. To recap, my 130-pound weight loss came from drinking mostly water, eating less, constantly adjusting my diet, staying extremely active, and embracing the placebo effect. There's that mentality. You just gotta believe in everything that you do is working, honestly. Now, 10 years later, I got a new challenge. I gotta lose 200 pounds, my guy, and I'm trying to build muscle. I'll share my detailed plan in an upcoming video, so be sure to subscribe. For more updates and to support my journey, check out my page at bio.link forward slash mybestsr. Thanks for watching, and remember, if I could do it, so can you.